Hello, boys and girls, and thank you so, so much for coming to our party at a and United Methodist Church today. You know, in the past, I've always had a lot of fun meeting everybody and getting pictures made and having a lot of fun while we played here in the Great Hall. But as you know, there's a little problem with that. I, I want, one of the problems I had is, is the masks. You know, the mask thing is a difficult thing because I can't find one that, I, there's just not a mask that is Santa size. As you can see, it just doesn't fit. And you think that's a problem. The real problem is trying to find a mask that fits on the reindeer. Absolutely no mask that is made anywhere in the world fits on reindeer. And with Rudolph, with his nose, it shines right through. So here we are. I'm just going to come to you on video and talk to you and say hi. You know, I get a lot of questions, being Santa Claus and all. One of the questions I always get is, why do you always bring presents to children? Well, there's a really good reason for that. It's because children can be so nice to each other. It's been a tough year for a lot of people, but I know that you'll do the best you can to be nice to one another and be nice to your family and whatever you do, be nice between now and Christmas Day because that's kind of the deal. The other question that I get the most is, am I on the naughty list or am I on the nice list? Well, I, I did a little, I did a favor, I think, for some of you. I brought with me today a uh, listing of some of the good girls and boys who are going to be here today. I know that that's very important to some of you. Let me take a look. So pay attention and hear, and I hope you hear your name. Um, the Bonugli family, the children there, Autry, the Brock children, Bynum, Calloway, Chan, Childs, and see Santa always does everything in alphabetical order. The Drake family, the Hall family, the Henderson and Hoffman and McCannon family, McLean and Meyer. Those are the children that I know about that were going to be here. So I thought I would just kind of, you know, give you a little preview that you indeed are on the good list. So I'll put this down over here now and remind you also that whatever you do, that's not the only good list. If, uh, if you keep being nice and you keep working on it, then you'll be on the good list too, and I'll see you Christmas Eve. So that's the rule. Remember, go to bed early on, on uh, Christmas Eve. Do what your mom and dad say. Put out, oh, I almost forgot the most important one. Put out the milk and cookies and be sure and be nice to all your friends between now and Christmas. And one other thing I forgot, because I can't be there with you, I put together a little present. There's a present that's on your table and it is magic snow straight from the North Pole. So be sure and don't lose this because in just a little bit, we're going to get to make an awful mess. So stand by. So I'll see you Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas, boys and girls. <laughs>